Okay, so I had some questions on how to download your Facebook friends list. So I'm going to show you a couple easy steps on how you can do this and maximize your business. So the first thing you want to do is you go to Facebook and you're going to click up here where there's that little drop down triangle and you go to settings. Click on settings and then right here at the bottom it says download a copy of your Facebook data. So it's that easy, right? Then you go up and you're going to click start my archive and then it will make you type in your password, you type in your password, I'm not going to do it because I've already done it here, um, and then it will give you a little notification saying it's started and it's going to send you an email when it's ready. So, um, you know, this can take anywhere, it depends on how big your friends list is and it's going to save all of your data to not just your friends list. So it can take anywhere from a couple minutes to a couple hours, then what will happen is you get an email and it's going to look like this and say that your download is ready and it will have a link in it and you click on that link and it's going to open everything that you have okay so you download that information it will open everything you have it will save to a zip drive and it's going to save mine saved to downloads but then I went ahead and moved it to my desktop just so that it would be a little easier so here we go you have this uh, folder right here is that Facebook folder and so it's got photos, videos, an index, and then if you come over here to your HTML, and it's going to have everything, like everything you've ever done. So right here where it says friends, then you right click, and you go to open with, and I'm going to open mine in Excel. And it gives me an error message, just bypass. And there you go. So I have everyone, and as you can see, it not only includes your list of friends, but it puts them in order of when you became friends, which is great for follow-up. And so then you can just go in, add columns for notes, whether you've contacted them, put people into lists, and it makes everything really easy for you. So I hope that's helpful. Let me know if you have any questions. Thanks.